Good evening, Toronto. I'm Ontario Premier Kathleen Wynne. Bonjour. Jamla, jamla, Kathleen Wynne. You know, like all of you, I am thrilled that Toronto has elected a new mayor. I couldn't be happier that the winner has won, and I look forward to working with the winner on many of Toronto's important issues. You know, these past couple of years have been difficult ones for the city, and for me personally, trying to avoid contact with former Mayor Rob Ford. If you've ever been standing in line at the ATM and a man with no teeth sidles up to you and tries to sell you an empty iPhone box and won't take no for an answer, well, that's pretty much exactly what my last two years have been like dealing with former Mayor Rob Ford. Now that the winner has won, I will no longer have to screen my calls and will be able to get down to the business of dealing with Toronto's many issues in that liberal way that ensures not too much gets accomplished. And I'm sure the winner will be a perfect partner in this endeavor. I'd like to congratulate each candidate personally on their campaigns, but honestly, I can't think of any particular memorable moment from any of them. I guess that's why we're here tonight congratulating the winner. They really showed Toronto what can be accomplished when you don't smoke crack or do anything else at all interesting or engaging. I am glad, however, of the focus on transit in this campaign. Each candidate did a wonderful job highlighting the need for the transit plan the Ontario government was going to implement no matter what the election outcome. So good job all. Now, I know some of you are thrilled at the outcome tonight, and many more of you are disappointed. But I'd just like to remind you that the mayor is only one vote on council. The real power to affect Toronto lies with the council as a whole, and more importantly, with the province. Which means me. So don't be too disappointed that your losing candidate lost. Compared to the power in these strong lesbian hands, the mayor of Toronto is about as powerful as the D cells left over in my bedside table. <laughs> so, to the new mayor, I say congratulations. And you better stay in line, or I will de-amalgamate this joint so fucking fast your head will spin. Congrats.